Um, a couple of days ago, as I am recording this, sadly, Akira Toriyama, the creator of Dragon Ball, passed away. Um, rest in peace. Dragon Ball was actually the first ever anime I ever watched. Um, I used to go to this daycare place, right? Because, you know, I was a kid and whatnot, and I'd go to daycare. And sometimes uh, my daycare provider, she'd have it on Cartoon Network, and it'd be like, I don't know, 6 or 7 in the morning, and they'd be playing Dragon Ball. And it was... Uh, it was always like the Saiyan saga, but I always I like vividly remember seeing Goku versus Vegeta, their first ever fight when I was like really, really young. So yeah, Dragon Ball was the first ever anime I ever watched. I have so much love for Dragon Ball. I love the game, Dragon Ball Fighters. I love Xenoverse. I love Budokai Tenkachi. I don't know which one I played, but I used to go over to my friend's house and play in this 360. Um, I just really love Dragon Ball. And today I wanted to talk about my favorite moment ever in dragon ball history and this is when gohan goes super saiyan 2 for the first time teen gohan is my absolute favorite dragon ball character ever he just he he looks so cool and i mean you know all throughout the fight you know go gohan gohan has he we we know gohan can go can get stronger than what he's showing us right now right because we have seen they have made references to it all throughout the show gohan's really strong he just doesn't want to tap into that strength and that anger but then you know cell he finally kills um android what 16 yeah he kills android 16 and then that just that just pushes gohan over the limit right we get that little that that iconic scene where, like the, the red light flashes and then he just lets it all out he screams and then ah, he's like ah you know he goes he goes super saiyan 2 for the first for the first time and then there's that that really cool scene where gohan's just like his hair is flowing in the wind and there's just tears falling down his eyes and he's he's ready to go crazy and cell you the the, the camera zooms in on cell and cell he, he knows he's cooked look at his face look at his face the dude the dude knows he's cooked right all right and so then you know gohan he then proceeds to dismantle all of all of the baby cells and whatnot and i don't know does he, he he just looks cool his character design itself just looks fantastic i love it i love it in every form of media ever i just this design this design is peak dragon ball design the purple and the blonde hair just looks really cool and then vegeta's over here glazing this man this entire fight he's like oh there's no way he's dodging all of cell's attacks i'm the prince of saiyans and i couldn't defeat cell how is this child defeating cell and it's like the entire fight vegeta is just glazing the mess out of gohan but i mean as he should as he should Gohan was the only one out of all of them who could actually put up a fight, right? And then I think, I don't know what happens, but like, I think he defeats all of the baby cells and then he finally like takes Cell on one-on-one -on -one, and they start throwing hands and he's absolutely dismantling Cell. Like, there's there's no way that uh, Cell wins this. And then Cell says to himself, he's like, oh, is this what it's like to feel fear this for the first time? <laughs> and then my favorite part, right? Gohan walks up to cell and he's like what are you so afraid of cell isn't this what you wanted i warned you i told you this would happen if you took this too far you forced me to awaken my hidden power and now that you've seen it you're afraid bro 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 go on go on got that dog in him and then like cell does his like ultimate kamehameha and like gohan completely like his 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 kame his kamehameha is bigger like he just boom, 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 and then I like I that was that was a terrible description of of events, but like you 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 get it. Cell's Kamehameha was his ultimate one, but Gohan's was just better. And you know they really implement this really cool in Dragon Ball Fighters because you know Gohan his like his like 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 Cell is shooting his beam from the sky, and Gohan has to like do an uppercut, not an uppercut, but like. A diagonally upwards version of the Kamehameha to like counteract it and they did that as a super move in Dragon Ball Fighters but we go on in the fight and then you know I think Cell like blows himself up or something like that and then like Goku like teleports him away but then I don't know somehow Cell comes back I really can't remember I haven't seen this arc in a while but Cell comes back and he's like even stronger and then Gohan really has to put in work and then we get the iconic 
father-son Kamehameha scene. It's just that might, no. That's not my favorite super move in all of Dragon Ball, but I don't know. The scene itself, the music, and the voice acting is just really cool. I've only seen the English dub of Dragon Ball Z. I've seen Dragon Ball Z Kai. I don't know what the difference is between Dragon Ball Z and Dragon Ball Z Kai, but I've only seen the dub version of Dragon Ball Z Kai, and it's just, it's just so good. It's so fun to look at. Um... I don't know, bro. It's just like go, like not go on. Yeah, like, I was, bro. My words, my words are everywhere. It's just like Gohan's aura is just oozing out of him. Like the way he walks and moves, the confidence is just so cool. I love Team Gohan. They don't, they don't make Team Gohans anymore. And then he got nerfed, Loki. I don't know. Like he's still strong, but like I don't know. He's never looked that cool since then. He hasn't had that same aura he used to have during the cell arc and it's it's honestly a shame but uh yeah that's my favorite moment in all of dragon ball um i thought that this video would be longer but it isn't let's talk about some of my other favorite characters i really love vegeto um i love his first fight against uh boo and he's just using his legs he doesn't even need his arms he's like no i'm not i'm not gonna use my arms i'm gonna cross my arms and i'm just gonna i'm just gonna kick you to death um I love Gogeta, the Gogeta versus Broly fight, oh my gosh, beautiful, animation, top tier, um, love Gogeta, I love Goku Black, um, he's just, he's just really, his, his personality is just, like, really, really funny, um, but yeah, Dragon Ball really means a lot to me, it has inspired me in many ways, it's cool to see how it's inspired all of my favorite shows, um, you know, One Piece, uh, Naruto is not one of my favorite shows, but it is cool to see how it was inspired by Dragon Ball. I mean, Dragon Ball inspired so many great creators. I was I was looking, and they were saying that like um, Toriyama is kind of like the grandfather of all modern mangaka, and you know I think that that's true. His his influence is is crazy, and it's sad to see him go so soon. But um, yeah, I just wanted to make this video. In honor of him, thank you for making great art. If you're still here watching the video, thank you for watching. Um, Dune 2 video coming very soon. I saw Dune 2 today, and oh my gosh. Stay tuned, stay tuned, stay tuned. But uh, yeah, drop a like, subscribe, join the Beam Team, leave a comment and whatnot. And uh, yeah, I love you. Have a great day. Peace out.